I open one eye. What's happening to them over there? I saw miracle. I said I saw miracle. Welcome to the heavenly arena where we bring you Holy Ghost inspired and heavenly curated sermons. This short excerpt is going to reactivate your faith and draw you closer to God. Please remember to subscribe to our YouTube channel and follow us on Facebook for more heavenly materials. God bless you. It was 1985 and we called, uh, you know, a dramatist, Baba Salatio, help us publicize the crusade. And he did a wonderful job. The Lord bless him and his team. Say amen. amen. And so they gathered people there. And as they gathered people, blind, lame, everybody. And they were going to the stadium through Larry here. And uh, so the crowd pouring in and I have been preparing I'll tell you so that when it comes to your turn because it will come to your turn you will know how it was done you will do it I'd prayed I'd fasted I'd read I'd listened to you know some helpful faith tips and then the day came I was going I was in the car. The driver, of course, was driving. I was sitting by this side, as I always do. And as I looked out, I saw people on crutches. They were like, I, I removed my eyes. I looked another direction. I don't blame me. That was my first time. I don't do that now. So if you do that, I'm like you, you are like me. And so we got there, and I was thinking, these people are waiting for blind eyes to open, the lame to rise up and walk. I didn't know about that, but I said, I know the salvation message. I'll preach the salvation message with all my heart, all everything I have. And I preached the salvation message, and I gave the altar call. But I knew the people were still waiting. They were waiting for, what were they waiting for? Miracle. Miracle. And so, you know, counselors, uh, thank you very much. God bless you. Members of choir and ushers who are there. Get the names and write legibly. Inside me, as you know, I say that, there was uh, what will happen tonight. And so, the time came. If you are going to die, you only die once. And I said, I'll give it all it takes. And so I said, you're sick. I shouted, but internally, there was fear. Raise up your hand. The Lord will heal you today. I didn't say I will heal them. I said, the Lord, who is going to heal them? And so we closed our eyes and I prayed and prayed and prayed. I didn't know how to stop the prayer because I didn't know what will happen. In the middle of the prayer, I had shout. There was a mother who brought a child, one leg had no bone. It was all flesh and a white that uh, a kind of fleshly uh, leg and round the stick and be hopping. But in the middle of the prayer, when I had half faith, half fear, a miracle happened. God created bone in that leg. And before we said the final amen, the boy threw away the seed and began to walk. And the mother saw that. And the mother began to laugh and cry and jump and dance. I opened one eye. What's happening to them over there? I saw miracle. I said I saw miracle. And so, next I said, anybody there, where are you? God is touching you now. And God touched them. And from half faith to and half fear, I had zero fear, zero fear and 
total faith and I pass it on to you I pass it on to you your time has come say my time has come behold behold I give unto who you power to tread on serpents and scorpions and over 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 all the power of your enemy and nothing shall by any means hurt you nothing 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 shall by any means hurt you in jesus name